Baker's lost. Damn! Damn! Pain, they love it. Life's like a merry-go-round. Now I'm still trying to figure it out. I like space, I don't fit in the crowds. My whole life, I've been. Alright, so what's going on guys? My name is Yoshino PZ. Welcome back to the channel. Today what I have for you guys is the best classes to use in hardcore. Hopefully you guys are having a great Christmas or Christmas Eve whenever I upload this. Hopefully you guys are having a great Christmas, you know, spend some time with your family, uh, you know, play some video games. I know a lot of you guys got World War II, so shout out to you guys. Enjoy the lobbies. They're juicy, trust me. So the gameplay, you guys are probably gonna watch after me talking about the best classes. This is a gameplay where I was actually in hardcore using the same exact class setup. Now I'm using a Type 100 with Quick Draw, a Cinemax, and FMJ. You guys are probably like, FMJ? Why FMJ? I will tell you guys in a little bit after explaining why I'm using certain things in this class. I'm using a P08 pistol with the Cinemax, Frag Grenade, and then for my basic training, you guys are probably like, why are you using Huckle? Oh, a hunkle, a huckle, whatever you want to call it. Now, huckle literally is a god basic training for hardcore. Ease uh, early grenade warnings, right? Also, you take less damage from explosives. In the gameplay, you guys see me getting naded, everything in the book. And I legitly survived all of that stuff. And it's it was it was insane. I was like, why am I surviving all this? And I forgot on this class that if I had this basic training going. Now, if you guys don't have this basic training, don't worry. You will still have this type of perk on. Now, there's a, a division called Armored, and Armored allows you to r take less explosive damage, take less fire damage, and also can have a tactical and a grenade on. So you can have two of that. Wait, wait, wait. I lied. I lied. Okay. Take that back. Rewind. It doesn't allow you to do none of that, but you take less. You're immune from shell shock. If you get ever get naded by your teammates, you can, uh, you, you know what I mean by shell shock. Your screen starts shaking like King Kong coming around for Christmas. Like, it's crazy. And also, you get a tactical equipment. Uh, you know, you, you're immune from all that too from your teammates. So, all that is great. And, you know, that's great. But I don't even care about none of that stuff. I take, the only thing I care about is take less explosive damage. That's the only thing I care about because in hardcore, people just chuck nades. They just chuck them. They just, they just throw them across the map. They hoping to get at least one kill. If you have this basic training on, you are set and you are legitly your golden. Now, you guys can rock any you can guys rock any other weapon. Uh you guys can rock, you know, the M1928 or the MP40. The MP40 is amazing in hardcore. Uh you guys can it's, I'm going to be setting up classes right now. You guys can literally rock this class right here in hardcore. You don't even have to ADS with this weapon. You can literally just hip fire with it, and it's insane. So you put steady aim on it, and it betters the accuracy while hip firing this weapon from the hip. A cinematic, so you know you don't like run out of ammo. It comes with 48 in a clip, which is pretty good. Uh, grip, you don't even have to put grip on. To be honest, if you're just hip firing, you know, you can put on advanced advanced rifle, and literally, it's just hip fire people, and that's honestly it. Or you guys can go to an AR, right? And y'all can literally get one shots. The M1 Grant, uh, you know, you guys can literally just put on that. And then FMJ. Oh, this is what I was going to explain to you guys. Why I'm using FMJ. So in hardcore, people like the head glitch a lot. And if they're behind, like, a, a object that's not solid, or if it's solid, you can still shoot through, I bet, because this game, anything can happen. Uh, FMJ, you can shoot through that and kill them still. So, if somebody's behind a box, say, for instance, we're playing on London Docks, and we're at the A flag, right? And somebody is behind that box that's leading to the little bunker room back there, the, the storage room. Uh, and somebody's behind that box, all you gotta do is literally wall bang the box, and you can literally easily kill them, which is great. And, you know, you don't have to, like, aim for the head, because in this game, I think sus, uh, hitboxes in the head is so weird. Uh, so... I use FMJ for hardcore purposes just because of that. You can just shoot through the box and you may get lucky and get a double kill. You know, if your bullet is that strong, uh, you know, anything is possible in this game. Uh, but you could also rock the M1A1 carbine or the FG42 or the bar. Anything in this game is literally a slapper. But like I said before, if you guys want some good gameplay, all that good stuff, I'm rocking quick draw, FMJ, and a Cinemax on the Type 100. And the gameplay. Featuring, I'm 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 gonna be telling you guys how to play hardcore safe and how to play 
uh, correctly. But anyways, hopefully you guys did enjoy the beginning of this video. Now we're about to go straight into the gameplay. So enjoy and uh, leave a like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications so you guys never miss a video. If you guys are brand new to the channel, if you guys are Christmas noobs, don't be afraid. I, I'm not here to hunt you down in lobbies and smack you. I'm here to help you. I'm here to make you get gooder. If you guys know where that's from, you, you, you guys won't roast me. But I'm here to make you guys get better at the game. But anyways, I catch you guys in the gameplay. Peace out. Alright, so what's going on guys? My name is Yoshi PZ. Welcome back to the channel. And today what I have for you guys is a video where I'm going to be basically showing you guys and telling you guys how to play hardcore better and how to survive longer in hardcore game modes. Now hardcore, you need to have some good reaction time. Now the class I showed you guys in the beginning was a type 100. I'm using that type 100 in today's video. I hopped on yesterday for the first time. And a lot of people can vouch for me. If you guys were watching Dismal Stream, it was literally my first game on. I hopped on. And this class legitly slapped. <laughs> like, this Type 100, for some reason, gave me, like, superpowers. But hopefully you guys are having a great Christmas. Hopefully you guys got everything you wanted. Um, you know, if you guys can do me a huge favor, drop a like on today's video. Subscribe if you guys are brand new. We're gonna, bring, we're gonna be making more content. And later on, I'm gonna be streaming later on for you guys. Do an open lobby uh, for you guys. Add some people as a, you know, Christmas gift. Follow some people back. Do the little giveaways on the, the stream. All that good stuff. You know, hopefully you guys can come through and, uh, you know, chill in the stream and all that good stuff. So today, I'm gonna be showing you guys the best Type 100 class setup in Hardcore. So I'm using Grip. No, actually, I'm not using Grip. I'm using Quick Draw, a Cinemax, and an FMJ. Now, I'm using FMJ because if somebody's head glitching behind a wall or some type of, like, you know, object that, you know, it's going to be hard to take somebody's head off of, I can easily, I can easily shoot them uh, through the object and then I can kill them. Uh, but uh, other than that, that's the reason why I'm using FMJ. Now, hardcore game mode, you got to be careful. You got to be careful. You know, a lot of people be throwing nades. A lot of people be camping. And they be doing a lot of stuff. And, you know, it's kind of annoying on how some people play hardcore. Some people literally camp in the back of the map with an LMG just waiting for the person to actually, um, you know, come through. And you can just pick them off easily. But what I think you guys should do is actually go into outside. You can actually do this on core and hardcore game modes. You know, you don't have to legitly stay on one, uh, you know, one area. You know, I actually stayed on one area on the map because, you know, Christmas noobs are out. Uh, sorry if you guys are, you know, part of the Christmas noob era. You know, I love this time of year for Call, for Call of Duty because every single person that plays the game right now are level one. So if you guys want to, I'm going to tell you guys a little hint. Start up a core TDM and you will get into a lobby with at least four level ones. And I'm telling you, I'm telling y'all, drop a V2, all that good stuff. Tweet me a picture of you dropping a high streak. My Twitter is inside the description. While you at it, follow me on Twitter. But my Twitter is inside the description. Tweet me your best score line that you guys get today. Tweet me your best score line. I need to know what the best score line is for you guys. All of that good stuff, you know. I want to know. I really want to know what your best score line is. But to play hardcore, you need to have, uh, you know, this is ADS, ADS a lot. Quick draw helps a lot too in hardcore game mode, especially the Type 100 really doesn't need grip. The grip on the Type 100 you really don't you don't need because the gun has no recoil whatsoever. You can actually control the recoil pretty good. So I have Quick Draw, Acidic Mags and um fmj now also if you guys a little get a little freaky with it you guys could actually pre-fire the corners that's why i have a cinemax too so i can pre-fire around the corners just in case just in case somebody comes through i can easily pick them up and uh yeah but that's how i'm playing hardcore in this game mode luckily uh, i was playing with my boy dismo and fortunate uh, in his gameplay you know hopped on first game on like i said before and i i was clapping the cheeks so I need you guys to clap the cheeks with me too. I need you guys to show me how dominant you guys are in the playing field. I need to know. I need to know if you guys are at that level, the same level as me. I need to know. But guys, this V2 is pretty damn good. Now, luckily, nobody was throwing nades in this game. Uh, but, you know, I still have that one basic training perk on for you guys. I still have that one basic training perk on. But hopefully, you guys are having a great Christmas uh, so far. If you guys are, drop it a like. And uh, comment down below what you guys got for Christmas. Also, you know, don't forget to tweet me your best score line. And um, this is the Ocean PZ, and I'm out. Peace. Make 
Marker's lost. Capturing Abel. 